a barrel here is going to be named Cope. Oh my goodness, I about had to hit that timestamp button. I'm worried about switching out into just about everything because this is level 26 Reggie Rock. Your name will be... Got him. Ooh, what's up, Cloud Residents? And I'm Dr. Cloud, and I'm welcome back to the sixth episode of this awesome 30% boosted series that I'm doing great at. I haven't had to restart a single time. And in the last episode, I made it through this dumb forest with some girl who really needed my help, and I always appreciate helping them women out here. So, I showed the team off last episode. I'm just kind of going to boop, 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 boop. Look at them. They're great, aren't they? Check out the layout if you really want to see who they are. And I'm gonna jump into this episode and we're gonna get things rolling. Uh, I don't get an encounter here, so I'm not worried about it. I think there's an item down here probably. There isn't, that's super surprising. I'm definitely not gonna battle them if I don't have to. I do want the berries though. You never know when a berry's gonna come in handy. Fun fact, I don't like any type of berry. <clears throat> Not a very big uh, fruits and vegetables guy. I'm really trying to think. There's not a single type of berry that I actually eat. Don't eat strawberries, raspberries, blueberries, blackberries, watermelon, you know. All them berries. <laughs> Could have encountered an area dose. That would have been interesting. With download. Okay. I see you. I see you. You out here. Uh, what I got over here? Ooh, okay. All right, I'll take it. I'll take it. Bigger heals 120 HP, but it kind of lowers your friendship with your Pokemon. Let's check if I am right about what I just said in my words. Uh, let's see. It's a hold item that boosts the power of HP stealing moves. So I'm completely wrong. So rub that in my face all you want. I'm fine with it. <laughs> <sighs> Looks like there's some kind of team, uh, team Magwa stuff to do here, you know? Oh, I got a friendship checker. That's cool. I might need that if I get my Zuzu back. Zuzu! Is this a bike shop? Ooh, bike shop! I would definitely take a bike if he's passing him out. Um... Okay. Uh, I don't know what to do here. Maybe I talk to her? Okay. I don't know if I'm supposed to do something after that. Uh, I think I'm just gonna spend some time running around real quick. So I just wanna check out the town, see if there's, wait. Oh, don't tell me you don't have an Explorer's Kit. You should have a word with the man next to the Pokemon Center. Okay, let's go talk to the man next to the Pokemon Center. Uh, hang on, I do want to talk to these other people just to be 100%. I don't know. Ooh, there's an item. Hang on, I need to grab this Master Ball real quick. Give me a second. I mean... I got the choice specs, I got the choice car. What else do I need, am I right? Choice specs. Oh, that's my second choice scarf. So I actually need a choice band. I'm guessing it's this guy. Okay, underground ground man's house. Okay, it's this guy. Ah, there we go. I got the Explorer's Kit. Yes. Okay, guys. So, I'm going to do something real quick here. Is I'm going to go ahead and make a cut. I'm going to make a cut, and I'm going to run back to Orberg, and I'm going to see what that fossil is. So, cut time. Bop. And I am back. Okay, so it looks like I should be able to do this fossil restoration. Some let's see if we can find out what it is. Uh, I said some needs some time. 
So I'm guessing I'm probably gonna have to drop something off in the PC so I can uh, put it into my party because I doubt they're just gonna put it automatically into the party or into the PC. So I'm gonna go ahead and drop someone off. Uh, I'm gonna drop off party for right now. You guys may see that I have Kecleon on the party. I did have to grab him to uh, get back here because I had to rock smash my way back here, so. All right, let me go check out, see what this fossil is. You were too long, kept us waiting. Yeah. That's hilarious. I got me a plant buddy, another plant buddy. Uh, ooh, yeah, there we go. Let's, let's use that. All right, so this this big old boy here is going to be known as uh no i'm not spelling flower wrong he is known as flavor so enjoy that name oh he's level 20 all right got the ability rain dish that's not bad and a pretty decent move that uh, him and a uh, party are basically in the same party, if you know what I'm saying. Uh, they both are like mid-stage starters, so now all I need is a bay leaf, and I complete the set of grass starters. That's pretty great. Oh, I did check out the Weeping Bell uh, while I had a chance, and it has the ability Honey Gatherer. So, you know, not the best, not the worst. Um, all right, and we're gonna make another cut right here and I am back. All right, so we're back in the name of this town that I definitely don't know what it is. And I'm gonna finish exploring out this town a little bit more. Name Raider, okay. Need to rename our Torterra anyways. I don't, I don't remember if anyone else needed nicknames still, so I might go and check that real quick. Uh, let's see, what are we nicknaming Torterra? <laughs> Perfect. Oop, forgot to click back in the game, hold on. All right, this big old boy is gonna be named Adventure. Which definitely makes me think about Adventure Time, which is a very, very deep show. I very much noticed that Cartoon Network has just been putting out, like, really deep shows over the last few years. Weasel for Chat Tot? No. But I feel like there's something in this house. Uh, nope. Nope. Ah, here we go, here we go, we got a TM, we got a TM. And what is it gonna be? Yo! I got Shaman's signature move! And it's not even supposed to learn it till level 100. I might be able to give Shaman that. I might, I might wanna hold on to it. That's amazing. It's such a busted move, too. Oh, hang on, I missed the other kid. I got it, I got him, I got him. I'm not getting him. There we go. Okay, I got him. That's so amazing, though. I'm gonna check really quick, though, if uh, anyone else in my da -da -da -bop PC uh, still needs a nickname real quick because this is my time to do it while I have the name reader right there because I don't really enjoy running back I just had to already run back uh, all the way to Orberg which is so out of the way all right good everyone has a name it's literally just the very first Pokemon I got that didn't have a name that's always what I like to do all right what's you were saying hey you trainer never mind uh Seems about right. <clears throat> oh, is this a rival battle? He's taking me somewhere. 
Oh, it's a whole like story thing. Even though I haven't played the game, I feel like I get the gist of the story. Evil guy wants to take control of legendaries, etc., etc. Like, I don't really feel the need to read a lot of the dialogue. But I, it's like I kind of want to, but I also really don't want to. Ooh. We are ready to get that fire type already. Also get cut, because I want to get that item. Herb shop? Nah. Uh, maybe someone gives me a free, like, uh, sample piece. You know, that's one thing that's actually really cool. Uh, you ever go to, like, grocery stores on, when they have, like, sample days? Pretty good days, you know? Because sometimes it's hard to tell if you want to buy something. Um, sure. Okay. Alright, so he said something about uh, Dialga and Palkia. Sample day is pretty sweet, though. Like, you know, you, like I said, you can't tell if you want something by looking at a box, really. Like, like oh man, that, that final finished product looks really nice. But, like, is that something I'm actually going to take the time to make? You know? Uh, I'm really trying to decide if I get encounters or if I... Um, do the gym. I actually probably can do both. Let's go for both. So I'm going to start with encounters. So I'll switch Secure back out front. Take care of this damage for us. Um... Ooh, that's definitely an item right there. It's not an item. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, Rose Raid, what level is it? Oh, I can't. It's only 18. We're fine. The Gen 4 evolutions that they took from previous generations are... Majority of them are, like, top-tier uh, Pokemon in general. Not just evolutions, but just Pokemon. There are a few that I feel like just missed the mark. Um, I have to be looking at them right now to tell you which ones, but there are just a few that didn't quite land, I think, the way they were meant to. You know, actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pull it up. I'm going to pull it up. Uh, it shouldn't take me long, but I'm going to make sure to keep the battle going at the same time, so... Uh, let's see. No, I don't want the ads. Let's go Diamond Pro Pokedex. They're all towards the bottom, if I remember right. Um. So, let's see. I'd say some of the weaker ones are probably like Provo Pass. Yan Mega. Uh, Tangrowth, definitely. Licky Licky. Yeah. Probably like those three or three or four, however many I just said, are probably the weak ones. And all the rest of them are like just top tier amazing. Alright. Uh, ooh, I don't know if I want to say into that. I feel like I have Pokemon that could take these hits way better because it's probably gonna like confusion me right now. Let's go for Ghost. Let's see if Ghost resists or Seal resists Ghost. That's why I need a Fire type really bad. I did six. That's not bad damage. Let's see. Ooh. Oh, but your defense is ridiculous. All right. I'm going to have to find something else. But it's so hard to not hit the resistance of either Steel or Psychic. Especially considering, like, Torterra doesn't have a ground-type move yet. I mean, bottles like Vital Throw would be neutral, but Confusion is super effective. So I think this might just be, like, a work-through-the-pain kind of situation. Oh, I'm confused, that's right. And I hurt myself. Yeah, this is gonna be an annoying battle. There's not really much more I can do, though, I'm pretty sure. 
Because, like, even Torterra, like, the best thing I can do is bite, and that's not going to do a lot more anyways. And I do know, though, I just picked up... Ooh, I have two yellow flutes and a blue flute. Okay. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and use the yellow flute, and we're going to take care of this a Baronzong, who's taking literally forever for no reason. Bud? Bud. You have Hypnosis, and you have Confuse Ray. But guess what? I got both color flutes over here that's going to heal both of those. So unless you're working with Cute Charm and I don't have that third flute, you're doing nothing to me. Alright, I'm glad you didn't confuse me right there because I would have had to use another turn. Uh, I feel like your special defense might be weaker than your physical. Let's find out. I mean, maybe barely. And your last move's in prison, so yeah, Confusion is your only attacking move. Which, I mean, is kind of annoying, but, like, also not really. It gives me a nice idea of what I can actually do. And I'm not really worried about 6 damage most of the time, even if it crits. I can heal that pretty easily. I was already considering it myself, is this a trainer? I didn't even remember. Okay. Monk's confused. What am I gonna do? I am gonna play my flute. <sighs> Fun fact. I played the saxophone in middle school. The tenor saxophone. I was decent. Not great, not bad. I was decent. Right in the middle. Even a jazz band. That was a good time. I still remember a lot of the songs because they're just so engraved in my head. And it's been... Seven, eight years since I've played those songs. Man, this is just a battle with flutes. Oh, bro, I, I'm like uh, the, the Pied Piper. Yeah. Yeah, I, I like uh, uh, can control like animals and stuff with my flutes. That just sounds super sweet. Just my whistle's pretty strong too. If you didn't notice, I hope I didn't blow anyone's ears out with that. I tried to whistle softly. All right, here we go. We're gonna play our Pied Piper music again. <laughs> oh man, I'm kind of sorry. Sorry, how long this battle's taking. I really want to get these encounters, but, like, I really thought that, that pile of dirt was an item and not a trainer. Like, I don't know why exactly. Hey. Don't be mean to her. My dog very much does not like to be touched whenever she's, like, laying down relaxing. She likes to do her thing and just lay right there and not be touched. Just relax. And the cats like to brush up against her and lick her, and she is not about it. But they love her. <laughs> Ugh. Had a hair in my mouth. Animal struggles. Now I'm gonna see how what my HP. Oh, it's my encounter actually. <gasps> Yo! <laughs> Another series that I get myself. Yes. Oh wait, am I dead? Oh, I'm good. Okay. We resist that. No problem. Oh, it's a crit too. Nice. That's so sick, though. I got another series where I get to use a Poliwag, Poliwhirl, etc. That's so awesome. Sobe, be nice to her. She's being loving to you. Seriously, the cats just want to, like, love her and be nice to her, and she just wants her own space sometimes. Which, I mean, I, I feel. I feel, but, like... So tough, because, like, sometimes you do need your own space, but, like, when someone's trying to give you love, you don't want to say no, you know? As much as I want to give this thing a name like Cloud, I, I'm going to keep with the theme of everything and go ahead and randomize a name for it. Yep, there we go. Perfect name. Matches me perfectly. Yeah. Look how perfect this name matches me. Oh, yeah. 
attraction. Mm, perfect. That's exactly what I think of when I look at me. Just attraction. All right, now I can pick up these potential other items that are here and aren't trainers. All right, deep sea scale. You know, it's super, super sweet that like I'm basically only you. Oh, and I needed a fire type. Oh, but you're so pretty. I want you. Ah, oh, that's a tough choice between Typhlosion or getting a Poliwag. For most people, that's not really a tough choice, but like for me, it 100% it is. Because I actually really do dig Poliwag. It's not just a mascot. It would definitely be a part of my gym leader team. Sophie, quit. Oh, I'm being talked to by Cynthia. Okay. Okay, talking to me about... Oh, she gives me cut, sweet. But I'm pretty sure I can't use it until I beat this next gem. Okay, give my regards to Professor Ro Ro Rowan. Rowan's his name, yep. Sophie. Be nice. She's not even really near you. She's just sitting here at the edge of the bed. Sometimes they like to uh, poke through the back of my chair because my chair has two holes like right about where my shoulder blades are. And they like to like reach their paws through and like poke me in the back. All right, what's attraction's ability? Sticky hold, not bad. I don't know what Jolly does, but it seems like your attack's pretty high. We have hypnosis, that's good. Quit growling at her. Her growls are such like baby growls. It's like all talk, no bite. All right, I know I can encounter it down here now. Ha ba ba ba. Maybe there's, oh wait, don't you give me something? Um. <laughs> nice. Hey, quit growling. She's laying next to you. Oh, can I not go this way yet? Oh, I need a bike. Do I have to like do something here in the city in order to get it? Or like, can I just go in now and get it after I've done that kind of story? No, definitely can't. All right, so I guess I'm gonna go the other way a little bit. Oh, no. Mm, I'm looking at the time. I think I'm gonna go ahead and go for the gym actually. I think that's a better play right now. Do, do I not need to battle her? Or do I have to talk to them to battle them? Okay. Yeah, we're, we're definitely gonna go for the gym here. Like, or I'm gonna at least scout out the levels. Let, let, let me say that. I can't imagine what this thing's gonna hit me with. Okay, but I can't hit it with anything apparently. Oh my goodness, what a thick boy. Boy, if I would have hit um, secure over there, that might have like really done some damage. But I got adventure, bro. We're gonna have an adventure climbing that tree on his back, especially with those spikes there. Like you fall off, you might just die. All right, they just gotta hit this tackle now. All right, I was about to say, watch me miss this tackle. Nah, but we good. We good. Um, I legitimately don't know if I'm going to be able to take on this gym leader right now. Because these trainers have... Alright, I'm going to play my cards right here. I know for a fact the Gabite has... Um, Dragon Rage. And on my strongest Pokemon, that's basically a um, two shots. No, it's actually three shot on bottles. I think. Ooh, okay, you're playing it careful on me. Alright, still, he still needs two Dragon Rages in order to take me out, so I think I've got this on him. 
Oh, thank you, Bottle, for having so much HP. Oh, man. I was not ready to deal with Dragon Rage. I'm not gonna lie, I still really want to use uh, Secure, but I don't feel like Secure has the strength right now to fight. Boy, that this takes a long time. I feel like you could have done it a little bit differently, like... Wouldn't have taken as long. Uh, I'm actually gonna switch to Monk. Monk can definitely fight for himself. Himself. Oh, you jump. Wait, can I just... Nope. <laughs> so basically... Wait, is there a hidden item over here? That'd be a crazy spot for a hidden item, wouldn't it? But it's so weird to... Like, I mean, I, I guess it's like aesthetically pleasing. So like, I can't get... I'm not gonna get upset. You know, that they put a nice, like, flower bed. Oh, boy. We send it out Azos over here? I mean, I guess I'm gonna just go for the Stomp. Like, I recognize that I have the Astonish, but I think Stomp's gonna do more damage. Plus, it outspeeds me, so I'm not really hoping for flinches. I did not know you got Detect. Very interesting. What attacking move, though, do you have right now? You only used him. Oh, there it is. Confusion. Hmm. That did more damage than I thought it would. Did 11 resisted. And I'm a level above this thing. You can't rest. Alright. Yeah, that's right. Uh, Stomp does more. This could end up being a long battle. I think this next Stomp taking out is going to be a roll. There we go. Taking out legendaries over here, Monk. All right, what's next, though? <sighs> There's a heat train coming out, and I just set the sun up for it. Oh, man, I'm gonna have to hope so much that Bottle can take a hit from this thing. So we're definitely going with the fake out. Like we're just gonna we're just gonna knock that out right now. Man, I need something. Okay, fire fang. Are we are we are we taking that? Okay, we didn't flinch or burn. That was great. Thank you, bottle. Oh, bottle. I don't think of anyone that resists this either. Oh, I do. I have secure, but I don't think secure is taking it. Uh, 50. 50. Oh, man. I don't know if 50 is enough. I think I was basically in that range last time. I can hope he goes for something else. Nope, another Fire Fang, and he might burn this time. Even if I outspeed with, like, Drill Peck, I don't know if I'm actually going to take him out. That's the problem. Oh, man, I'm using so much money on this. Like, I might be able to switch into someone and, like, take care of this guy, but... I don't know, like, a boosted Fire Fang in the sun... I'm gonna heal one more time and I see exactly how much damage this is doing. Cause I might be able to just go for the uh, the vital throw or the drill pack. Maybe probably vital throw. All right, let's see. 104 to 64, so it does exactly 40. So I probably can go. I can more than likely take. Oh, he goes for ancient power. 
I can definitely take an ancient power. Oh my goodness, you had an Azov and a Heatran? What is your last mon? Honestly. 30% boosted double legendaries. Oh, man. Last month's a Slugma. I can fight Slugmas all day, but you throw out Heatran and Azel? Gosh. I definitely did not mess up my grinding, I can tell that. Oh, my goodness. All right, we're good. We're good. We're fine. Sure. Yeah, I need these fountains to like calm down and not be on. Thank you. 100% need to go heal by super potions or something. So we're finishing this gym today. Like, I don't even care what the ace or gym leader's levels are. Like, it's happening today. Uh, I am going to go ahead and sell guard swap. That's of no use. I don't feel like mud slap's going to help me in any way. But I might see if Torterra can actually learn it. Uh, do I have anything more I want to sell? Yeah, I'm going to sell that. I don't really need it. don't really need honey for that matter, but I'm going to keep those. And we're going to buy some more super potions. Five, seven. And what does this other person sell? Ooh, you sell nest balls? We're picking some of those up. Those are those basically free catch on lower, um... Lower level Mon, which we definitely can still use. This PC or Pokemon Center like theme is so calm. This would be super chill music to put in the back of a stream. <laughs> Same with this town, just very calm, very methodical. I dig it. Oh, this gym doesn't reset. That's pretty cool. Oh, it does do it like that on certain parts. Like I said, we're going to go and finish this gym. This episode might be j just over 30 minutes. Alright, this is kind of a tough call. I'm going to have to see how much this first side beam does, and that's pretty much what's going to decide it. Yeah, the side beam is going to decide if I land it right now. Come on, Monk. You got this. I don't even know if I stay in at this point. I think it's hit the mic. Um, I mean, no one's really going to take this very well. So, like, I'm pretty sure he still has bite. I guess I'm just going to kind of, I'm gonna, just going to feel it out, I guess. Like, a wing attack. How much is that gonna do? Pretty handsome amount. <sighs> I don't want to stay in. That's the problem. Well, it doesn't have a super effective move on Ghost Rider. Ghost Rider might be able to just kind of clutch this for me. <sighs> it's really annoying that you just keep using Confuse Ray. I mean, you only got 10 of them, so I'm not too worried. I'm probably just gonna tail whip for a while and then just scratch. I was also definitely worried about bite, but I don't think that's actually gonna be an issue for me. You do have Astonish, which you couldn't hit. Uh, da -da. My name is Earl. You couldn't hit uh, Giraffe Rig with that. Oh man, this thing is gonna... Oh, you do have a bite. Okay, you just didn't bring it out. 
I was actually worried about something like that, where he's just holding on to that move in the back pocket. I'm convinced this thing has Serene Grace right now. It's flinched me three times in a row. Alright, I have to speed up. This battle is going to annoy me to no end right now. Okay, I definitely have to heal. Really don't want to, because I just bought the dumb super potions. Alright, we got two tail whips off. Let's go for a scratch, see how much it does. Does like a quarter, maybe? It's not great. I'm just gonna go for the tail whips again. Jeez. His wing attacks do so much damage. I'm going for it. Oh my goodness, you're so annoying. It's a problem fighting like a gold bat or any of that line with a psychic type, which is one of its few weaknesses, is that it gets bite and astonish. And now in like uh, more recent generations, it gets uh, leech life super early on. Actually, I think actually don't remember now like i think i think it gets astonished rather than leech life now all right guys gym battle time here we go i should have switched my lead but it's fine probably all right she's got three pokemon i think we'll be all right sand true okay i can fight a sand true I can't imagine really what you're gonna do to me. Like, are you just gonna like poison sting? It's the only thing I can really think of. Like, you have like scratch, poison sting. Like, you don't even have a ground type move. Got a rollout though. Okay, I see you. Uh, too bad that is not gonna last for you. All right, there's one down. I am 100% under leveled for doing this. Like, I don't even know how much to raise everyone. Lediba. Lediba should be a pretty easy takeout, honestly. So I think we're going to let Secure do this. Please let this be your ace. Last one was 26. What is this? 29. I think this is your ace. Oh, yes. Oh, I think it is because I think your ace always has a berry, too. Ooh, what a play. I just have to hope that you don't have a fire type on the back burner. You're definitely going to potion this thing. I swear, if I get swept by a Lediba with Silver Wind, I don't think I'll ever be able to forgive myself at that point. It's definitely going to knock you back down to the yellow or the red, and you're going to Super Potion again, which is actually good for me. I'd actually rather you Super Potion this thing than Super Potion a uh, potentially higher level Mon that's better. Alright, so let's find out. Is Ladybug her ace? Or is, or is this Sunflora your ace? Which I don't sleep on Sunflora. Okay, Ladybug is her ace. Nice. And has Intimidate. That's not fun. Alright, how much is Peck going to do now then? I uh, there's a quarter. I don't even remember what my ability is. Oh, he gave me insomnia? Alright, cool. So if you have grass whistle, I can't be hit by it. That's actually sweet. Oh, we got the crit? That's gonna do absolutely nothing to me. Two damage with a crit. I've been sitting on my tailbone for too long. So gotta record one more video too. Boom, boys. Boys and girls, we got ourselves a gym badge. Bam, timestamps. And I'm gonna check out what this team is right before we end it off. Uh 
Also, uh, there's a pretty good chance I'm going to do a little bit more grinding uh, after I finish this episode. So, before the next recording session. Ooh, Aqua Tail? That could be useful on adventure. Hit those ground, rock, fire. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and save. Um, so, guys, uh, this has been a pretty good time. Like, I beat a gym leader who had quite a bit higher levels than me and i actually did pretty well and i was lucky on the team to be fair so i hope you guys enjoyed the series where i still have not gotten a single death as far as i remember and i'll catch you guys on the next one later